I'm really scared to go home. If he has any friends or anything like that, so the officer said to stay away for a while in case someone else tries to. Um. <laughs> However, the tracker is out of my house, I hope. Um. Thankfully, thankfully, um, I have put all the gifts in a big container. I keep all the gifts that I've received from my fans in, in, in a big box. It's all in one place. So, I, I gave the box... Well, I had someone give the box to the officer and I think that it's no longer in the house but still yeah there's a tracking device there was a tracking device um I can tell you guys everything that happened um I mean I could just start from the beginning I suppose um <laughs> Stupid dog. <laughs> Stupid dog on my screen. <laughs> Be gone, you foul beast. <laughs> Thank you. Whoever did that, um, uh, it, it just all started when, um, I was collabing with Evil. Um, I wasn't live at the time, but I was on Evil's channel. Um, and there's a part, there's a part when Evil is talking to me, and you can see my model kind of go limp for a little bit. Because I heard a knock on my window, so I jumped out of my seat. And I was like, what the heck was that? <laughs> you can't hear me say anything, but I just jumped out of my seat and I muted. And I, I heard it and, and I just didn't know what happened. But then when I looked through the, um, like the security system that we have, there was no one. So this was like a knock on the window and then a runaway. Like they knocked and then they walked away. So that there was no one there. So I was like, what the fuck? Okay, so then I just assumed... I just assumed, guys... That it was like a kid being stupid. You know, like a, like a ding-dong ditch situation. Um, so I kind of just ignored it, and then I went back to doing my thing, and... Nothing happened for the rest of the day. <laughs> Literally nothing happened. <laughs> And I went to sleep, just fine, and there was nothing, there was no, like, detection on the, uh, like, motion detectors that we have. Um, and then the next day, the next day when I went live, uh, that's when it happened. He came back, he came back, and then, when I was live again... He only, he only wanted to interact with me when I was live or on someone else's channel, I guess. But, 
Um, yeah, I, I, I heard a big bang on the... On, on some door. I didn't know what he was banging on at first. But that first initial one was the first one that we heard. Um, and then... I'm dumb. I'm really stupid. I muted my microphone. Because if there was something going on, I didn't want you guys to hear anything. Because I feel like that would have been horrible to listen to. You know what I mean? L l let's say something did happen and then you heard... Absolute catastrophe in the mic. I did not want that. For people to listen to that. Um, <laughs> so I muted it. Um, in case anything happened. Because <laughs> I didn't want you guys to be scared. <laughs> um. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> I ran to my mom. <laughs> I ran to my mom to see if she was okay the first thing. And she was fine at the moment and she was just looking on the cameras that we have she was looking on the cameras and, and she said she saw him and he had a he had a fucking sledgehammer he had a sledge he, he, he didn't look like he had any weapons but he was trying to come in with a sledgehammer <laughs> it it didn't look like anything crazy. It was just like it was just like a stupid fucking sledgehammer that you can just get from anywhere. You know what I mean? Like like Home Depot or something. Um, but but he was banging on our garage with it, and that's what that loud noise was. Um, because our garage is connected to our house so he was trying to come in from there i guess um i don't know <sighs> but as soon as we heard that initial bang i pressed it just because i sorry i i pressed the panic button and and so my mom and i were hiding I'm not gonna say where, but we were hiding. And yes, guys, we have a weapon. A lot of people on Twitter were saying, Oh, well, that's why you're supposed to get a firearm. Yes, <laughs> we have a firearm. <laughs> we do. Um, I know how to use it too. Literally, for moments like these is why I even learned how to use it. I have went to shooting lessons with my dad very often in the past. So I know how, just in case we need to protect ourselves. Um, I'm telling you, we have like the most insane security imaginable. And I'm so glad that we did because... I really don't know what would have happened if we didn't. Um, so I encourage any other streamer and VTuber to please invest in that kind of stuff. If you have the money, it's... It's very worth it. Um... What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god! What the fuck? What the fuck? Why did you do that phone? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god! I'm not even fucking kidding! What the fuck was that? <laughs> did you hear her say, you're at? And then I started screaming. <laughs> Oh my god, get away from me! Oh. I'm so glad. 
I'm so glad I reacted the way that... Holy fuck, dude. It, okay, I need to mute my phone. How do I do that? Okay. Oh my god, my heart. Oh my god, my heart. Fucking shaking. Oh. oh my god, that just. That literally just would have been another situation where someone can show up to my house if they wanted to. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I did not mean to scream the way that I did. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. He's still here? No, he's not here. He is in jail. Oh my fucking... I'm so sorry for screaming that way. Guys. Holy crap. What is my luck as of recently? I, do, I don't understand. D does anyone know why she did that? Did I say something that... I think I said the word... I think... I think I said the word location. So that she just said location. I think that's why she did that. Um... Anyways, let me continue the story, I, I guess. Sorry, I'm freaking shaking again in my bootsies. Um... Holy shit. Disable? Meh. It's whatever, I don't care anymore. Ugh. Okay, okay, fine, 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 fine. Fine. You can disable? How do you disable? Uh... No, 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 no. How do I turn... Ugh. Turn off voice activation. Ah! Oh. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, yeah, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm turning off everything imaginable. Holy shit, thank you guys! Thank you guys! For... What the fuck? Thank you for all the gifted and stuff. Thank you guys. Uh, I don't know how to do it. I just press a bunch of buttons. Uh... Oh. Okay. Apple Intelligence. Eh, I don't know how to do that. It's whatever. Eh. Well. Hi, guys. <laughs> that was, um... That was... That was... That was really dangerous. Um... Okay, um... Um, I said on my Twitter account... Not my main one, but my alt account. I said something along the lines of... I feel like I'm being tested recently. <laughs> I feel like... I feel like I'm a kid in school again, and I'm just presented with a paper with the most horrible, horrible life events that could possibly happen to me. Um... But you know what? Don't forget to vote. You know what, guys? I'm not for politics. But Hannah Montana will be my president one day. Hannah Montana. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, so... You know, I was hiding with my mom with the weapon. And... The cops... It was so perfect. Thankfully, there was cops in the area. Black pink in your area. They were cruising around. I mean, okay. In my area, in my area, people are cuckoo crazy drivers. I swear there are alcoholics left and right with how crazy people drive around me. So there's always police patrolling the area anyways. Which is good. <laughs> it's good. So, as soon as I pressed the panic button, they, they were there in like 10 minutes. Which was really good. Really, really good. Um... We were hiding, and, um... It was kind of quiet, 
there was no sound happening besides him, you know, party rocking outside my house. And then we heard the sirens. And then he stopped. And then, um, you know, they, they, they caught him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Uh, so... It's crazy because I don't believe he tried to run or anything when they pulled up. I don't think they that he did. Cops never mentioned anything of that sort to me. Uh, but yeah, he was trying to break in my house with a sledgehammer. What his motives were, I don't know. I do not know. But uh, yeah, um, there's that. I... I told my family to pack their bags. <laughs> and I packed my bags and, and we skedaddled immediately. We... we heckin skedaddled. Um... We are not in the home. Oh... Uh, yeah... <sighs> and... you know... We didn't really talk much with the cops... Uh, after the whole situation happened. It was just like, are you guys okay? Blah, blah, blah. And we were just really freaking shaken up. So we didn't really want to talk much anyways. Um, uh, but the cops said that they would keep us updated with, you know, everything that went on and stuff afterwards. Because uh, we were leaving. So, yeah. Uh, gave him my number. And the cops informed me yesterday uh, that... He actually put a tracker in one of my gifts. I'm surprised the guy even... Oh, thank you guys. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, I'm surprised he even admitted to it. I feel like some person who is doing something no bueno as this was. I would have never expected him to admit what he did. But he did. He said to the cop that I saw her at a convention and I gave her something and there is a tracker on it. And so, yeah. Uh, I've... I've, um, told family to get rid of the box full of gifts. And I think they're gonna check them all for tracking devices. Even then, I, I don't believe I'm gonna keep it. Unfortunately, um, holy fuck. Freaking shit, what the... Guys, no... the hundred gifted and thank you for the bits everyone please 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 you really do not have to give me anything like that today i'm i'm really serious about that please do not do anything like that thank you so much though um um but yes uh so we're not gonna go home for a while, which kind of sucks. Because again, the officer made a really good point. He said it was just this one guy, but who knows if he has any buddies that he might have shared your location to as well. Um, so just stay away from the home for a while. And uh, obviously don't tell them when you return. Uh, um... It's really sad. It's really sad. Does the garage trigger alarms? Okay, so... I feel like I'm giving information. A lot of people would tell me to stop this. But like... Chat, we're probably gonna move. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> It doesn't matter. I think we've decided we're gonna move regardless, so... I mean, either way, I probably just won't answer it, but... Um... I'm really sad, because... 
Yeah. Quiet, okay, my lips are sealed. <laughs> well, either way, we have motion sensors throughout the entire house. Including outside, so, I mean... That answers that. Yes. We've, we've, we've taken so many things into consideration. Yeah. We're glad you're safe. Thank you. But yeah, uh, we're gonna move. Sadly. Sadly, um... A lot of people said you probably don't need to. But, um, it's always better to be safer than sorry. Just in case, you know? Because again, because again, nobody knows, nobody knows if he shared the information with other people, you know? So, we're probably gonna move and it's really sad because I really liked my house. But I really like my house. <laughs> he ruined it, yeah. He did. This is not even just any house. Like, we built our own house. We built it ourselves. And we, we chose how everything wanted to be. Like, this was our dream home, you know? So that's why it's really hard to move away from it. Um... Um... <sighs> and... I'm... Unfortunately... I mean, it's not really unfortunate, but I mean... Wherever we move next, I'm not telling the state anymore. People already know I live in Arizona, yeah, whatever, but... Wherever we move to next, I'm not saying the state anymore. Um, just to be safe, and, uh, I've talked to a lot of, um, managers and stuff, and <sighs> just a bunch of other people and some companies and stuff, and, and this is the unfortunate part, because I thought it was really cute, and unfortunately this guy had to ruin it for everyone else, but I can't accept gifts from fans anymore which is really sad because people used to give me the cutest things <sighs> you don't know how happy I'd be when someone would hand me like so people used to like make little Kim plushies for me like from scratch I know this really sweet girl, Kat Sundra, she made me like a, a really cute kimp made out of clay. <laughs> Someone gave me a Melanie Martinez vinyl. That really made me happy too, and oh my god, <laughs> my favorite gift of all time. Chat, this is my favorite one of all time. And, I mean, thankfully there's no tracker. I've already scanned it, um, and stuff, but, uh, this one, this one is a, um, cardboard cutout of, um, it's, uh, it's a cardboard cutout of, like, a, a jack-in-the-box from my lore video, and one of my... Longtime viewers, he went around WeebCon 
and he found every single camp that there was at WeebCon, and they all signed it. They all signed it. And so every single one of their names is on the little jack-in-the-box cardboard, and I have it sitting in the kitchen in my house. So... I never planned to throw away that one, because that one meant the most to me out of everything. I didn't put that one in the box, essentially. I have it sitting out, so I can always look at. <sighs> um... So yeah, I can't receive gifts anymore. I'm sorry, guys. I think... I think I'm gonna be making an announcement on Twitter about that soon. Um... And... I'm really sad to say this next part, but... Um... I think from here on out... Uh... Ah! <laughs> I, I choked on my snout bubble. Ew. 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 I'm sorry. Oh my god, that was so horrifying. I'm sorry, chat. Ew. Let me blow. <laughs> um, let me blow my nose, hold on. I'm gonna meal. <laughs> Please stop. Thank you for the hundred. Thank you. Thank you so much, Shimada. Thank you for the hundred so much. Thank you. A hundred buckaroos, a hundred bones, a hundred trading coins. Thank you. Wow. I could build a new home with that money. <laughs> 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 uh, I can build a hut. <laughs> I can probably build us an igloo with that kind of money. <laughs> uh. But, um... Uh, what was I talking about, though? Oh, yeah, I didn't say it yet. Uh, I probably can't... Mm. I'm sorry, don't be upset with me. Back in the jail cell where you belong. Put your hands up, dog. No more treats for you. Um. I. <sighs> I'm probably not gonna do IRL meet and greets anymore either. Sorry. Sorry. <sighs> you know how, first of all, thank you for the raid. <laughs> Um, appreciate you a lot. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, you don't know how depressing it is 
not being able to do IRL meet and greets anymore. Or getting gifts from fans anymore. I always used to tell my mom. I always used to tell my mom how cute it was to hug my, my fans. And then you can feel them shaking when they hug you. It was such a cute feeling. <laughs> You can literally feel them shivering as they hug you because it probably means so much to them. And I can't do that anymore. <laughs> and just seeing their smile right in front of me in person. Um. <sighs> A hundred... What the flip? What? <laughs> Holy shit, Shimada. Thank you. Ah, thank you. Thank you so much. Please, you don't have to do that. Thank you. You really don't. I'm so serial right now. You, you do not have to do any of that. Oh, thank you. Um, <clears throat> but he's such a nice guy. <sighs> thank you for the ton. <laughs> We're building you a new house. <laughs> I don't want to move, though. <laughs> I don't want to. I love my house. I've made so many good memories in my house. You know? I'm sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the 40 tier threes. What the fuck is wrong? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I need to blow my nose again. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna mute again. Hold on. Um. <laughs> Thank you guys for the subs and for everything. Thank you so much and all and all the followers. Thank you. Um All because of one fucking guy. <laughs> All because of one fucking guy, I have to move. <sighs> Fuck, man. It's tough. I feel like, I feel like, from now on, whenever I stream, I feel like I always have to one have, I, I can't speak, I, I feel like I need to have one ear open, like if I put my headphones on my head, I feel like I have to have one ear off, you know what I mean? Cause I'm just so fucking scared. It will happen again. <sighs> I 
I've literally been having the worst sleep imaginable too. Cause I just, I just keep thinking about that loud ass banging that we heard and how my mom was shivering. It was just so scary. saying the way he's looking at me. <laughs> he's so cute. No, he is not cute. <laughs> Would you guys adopt a dog that looked like that? Be honest. With his big old smile. He looks so picture ready. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. Thank you. Um. Yeah. Someone else also mentioned that if you want to receive gifts from fans, you probably just have to do it through Throne now. And they make a very, very valid point. Yeah, duh. But it's not as special, I feel. You know? From their hand to your hand. And then you seeing their smile when they give it to you. It's just not the same. Thank you for the subs. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Thank you guys. Thank you Space Guy. Thank you Victini. Thank you guys. Thank you, Skylar, for the five subs. Thank you, guys. Uh -oh. <laughs> Maybe you can receive drawings. No. I can't even open a P.O. box. I feel like P.O. boxes still would be dangerous, right? I just opened my P.O. box one day and it's a pipe bomb! Pew, 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 pew. Dead Mimi. Dead Mimi. <laughs> Why am I laughing? That's not funny. <laughs> oh, I have to blow my nose again. Excuse me. It's not delivery. <laughs> Sorry, I just saw something that was really funny. <laughs> I, I think someone just got an ad for my channel, and it was an ad about tomato soup. <laughs> And they were so mad about it. They said, tomato soup ad. And they did that. They put like the angry face. <laughs> Freaking tomato soup. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> that was funny though. Oh my gosh. Uh, Kevin. Thank you, Kevin, for the hundred gifted. Thank you, guys. Oh, fuck. Thank you for the hundred so much. Um. I have so much anxiety right now. 
Well, can I share some good news at least, guys? Can I share some spectacular news? <laughs> you know... Currently, we have flown to a place where there is very delicious food. <laughs> like, very good food. And me and my parents have been kind of like stress eating. <laughs> um, however, however, I've been walking every single day that I'm here still. And I have not gained a single pound. I'm very proud. I am very proud. I'm still, I'm still trying to avoid, uh, like fried foods and lots of sugar. It's more so I'm eating a lot of meat. <laughs> meat. Arby's. We got the meat. But <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> and, and yeah, I, I thought I'd gain weight from what I ate so far, but no. I, I, I'm still the same way as I, as I left, which is really good. Because, again, I'm trying to walk a lot, so I'm really proud of that. Uh, so that's good. Um, and also we have we have some really cool collabs coming this week, so I'm re I'm really happy and excited about them. I get to hang out with Fillion again. Yeah, hang out with Philip, and then I get to hang out with Vettel. My friends, I love my friends. They're good friends, and we're gonna play. We're gonna play games. It'll be a good time. <laughs> Yeah. It's gonna be good time. Yeah! Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> what you guys have been up to lately? Though, as I've been...